DaVinci Resolve for noobs. Here's a cool feature that might mess with your mind a little bit. Whenever you start a project, if you grab a video clip and bring it down into your timeline, it actually creates that timeline. And if you see in the upper left, timeline one. And anything you add or do within this timeline of this project will be represented in this timeline. And within any project, you can have more than one timeline going on at any given time. And you can create new timelines by right-clicking up in the gray area of the media pool, selecting timelines, and create a new timeline. And those timelines don't even have to conform to your project settings. You can change them to different aspect ratios, different frame rates, different vertical resolutions. But what can be really cool is you can actually take timelines and nest them inside of other timelines. For instance, this entire project here is right inside of this timeline. And if I select it and hit Control or Command C, and maybe I open up a completely different project and go up into the media pool and hit Control or Command V, it'll paste that timeline into a different project. And I can drag that right down into that other project. And you can see it's right there. That's the entire timeline and that project that I brought in. Now it's compressed almost like a compound clip would be, but you can right click on it and you can decompose in place right back to the original clips and you'll see that entire project inside of another project. Now you can't nest a timeline within itself. This timeline is from this project and I can't bring it down into its own timeline. It creates a bit of like an inception thing, which they actually call a recursion. But what you can do is right click on that timeline and you can duplicate that timeline. And then you can drag that duplicate back down into its own timeline. And then you can right click and you can decompose to the original clips and see the entire project of that timeline.